The chair of the Arizona GOP has been vocal in her calls for an audit to vote after President Biden won Arizona back in November. And now she's facing her own audit. Fox 10's Nicole Garcia is live with the details on this. Nicole. Kelly Ward narrowly won re-election as the chair of the Arizona GOP last week, and now those election results are being called into question by her own party. Won, or Ward, rather, won by almost 40 votes, and now her challenger is leading the call for an audit of that election. Well, I just want to officially congratulate Chairman Kelly Ward again for having won re-election. Tucson business owner Sergio Ariano conceded to Kelly Ward last week. Ward's been an outspoken critic of Joe Biden's win and a relentless promoter of election fraud. Ariano issued a statement on social media saying in part, I fully expect any audit to confirm the results that were announced at the state meeting. I anticipate the state GOP will do a solid job here and provide election officials around the state with an example of how to conduct a timely audit and how important ballot security and paper backups are. There was a lot lacking in terms of protocols and security of ballots and blank ballots and questions on um, what the controls were. Kathy Petsas attended Saturday's meeting and says election procedures and security were lax. She supports calls for an audit. We'll file this one under the ultimate irony. I certainly uh, don't see a problem auditing uh, this small vote. After all, Maricopa County uh, right now is going through an audit of its machines. Meanwhile, Kelly Ward has been unusually silent on social media in recent days. If you're willing to dish out some criticism, you need to be able to accept it yourself. And it is interesting that we're basically talking about the very same principle. And we're getting it down to election integrity. Now, we did make several attempts to contact Kelly Ward and the Arizona GOP for this story, but none of our messages were returned. So there's no confirmation yet on if an audit is going to take place. Reporting live, I'm Nicole Garcia, Fox 10 News.